Jay Drake, and I made this frame that you just saw out of boards that we started with from the Grover's Mill barn. And we start with boards like this, we cut them to width, clean them up with sandpaper, cut them to size, add a backer board on the back for, for stiffness, and we accented them with rosebud cut nails. Wow. What kind of wood is this? Do we have any idea? I believe it to be uh, yellow pine, which was a very common wood that they used for flooring. Uh, it's quite hard, it wears well, even though it is of the pine family. The old growth pine, which this is, what uh, was quite hard and, and durable. Great. And where's, where's your studio at? Okay, my studio is in uh, Nishanik, Hillsborough Township, New Jersey. And I uh, work out of a large garage there that uh, I started kind of as a, as a hobby project and it has uh, expanded to where, where I'm getting quite a few people that uh, show up and say hi. I, I heard of you and it's, it's all word of mouth. Great, great. And I heard you, you've done quite a few pieces in a, rest, a few restaurants in Princeton? I do, I do work for, uh, for the Momo Brothers. <clears throat> they own Enoterra, Metaterra, and Teresa's in uh, Princeton. And I uh, do their t do tables, tabletops, make some legs, uh, some artistic uh, accents on the walls, coat hangers, that type of thing. And uh, over the years have uh, probably last six or seven years, I've, I've done quite a few projects for them. Great. What's the most unusual product, largest or uh, most unusual thing that you've made out of wood? Well, the, uh, the larger ones are uh, walnut, uh, large walnut dining tables for uh, uh, Enoterra. Uh, probably a, an unusual one was I took uh, old barn beams from a barn that was being torn down, resold them on my sawmill, and uh, made a, a table for a client out of the old wood, uh, a custom size for a very large dining room. Wow. Wow. And how did they take you months and months and months and oh, months? Oh, no, it doesn't take months and months. <laughs> being, being retired and having a hobby and uh, being somewhat compulsive to get things done, yeah. Yeah, uh, probably about three weeks is all it takes. That's great. Well, you're, you're definitely a master in your craft, and I really appreciate what you did here with this frame. Thank and, you so uh, much for the opportunity to work with this historic wood. Thank you so much, and this piece hopefully will live forever. So, thanks a lot, Jay. Appreciate it. Thank you.